Hello everyone and welcome back to Electrical Field. Before we get started, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. In today's video, we're going to discuss a question that's very common among those interested in solar power. Why can't we use a car battery for a solar setup? Alright, so you might think it's a brilliant idea. After all, batteries store energy, whether they're in your car or linked to your solar panels. But it's not that simple. So let's break this down. The main differences come down to the way these batteries are designed to function. In simple terms, a car battery is designed for a quick energy burst to start the engine, while a solar battery is designed for deep, slow discharge where power is pulled gradually over a longer period. Here's a more detailed breakdown of the reasons. 1. Different purpose. Car batteries, also known as starter batteries, are designed to deliver short, high current bursts for cranking the engine. On the contrary, solar batteries are designed for long-term energy storage and are built to handle a deep discharge-to-charge -charge cycle. 2. Depth of discharge. Depth of discharge, or DOD, refers to the percentage of the battery capacity that has been used. Most car batteries should not be discharged below 50% consistently, as it can make them wear out faster. Solar batteries typically have a higher DOD, allowing for more usable capacity. 3. Lifespan. Because car batteries aren't designed for deep discharging, using them as solar batteries would significantly shorten their lifespan. Recharging and discharging solar batteries are meant to be done every day for at least 5 to 15 years, depending on the quality. 4. Cost Efficiency While car batteries might seem cheaper in the short run, using them for solar setups actually turns out to be more expensive due to their shorter lifespan and repeated replacement. 5. Safety Depending on the chemistry, some car batteries can be quite dangerous if improperly managed or if they fail. Solar batteries are generally designed with safety controls that regulate power delivery and prevent overheating. So while the concept of using a car battery for your solar setup might seem intuitive and cost-effective initially, it quickly falls apart when considering the technicalities and overall efficiency. For a solar setup, deep cycle batteries are recommended. They are designed for discharging smaller amounts of current over a longer period and for more discharge cycles. These can be lead-acid batteries like AGM or gel, or even lithium-ion batteries depending on your setup and budget. Always remember, the right equipment will not only make your setup more effective but long-lasting and safe as well. That's all we have for today. Remember that the batteries you select for your solar setup are just as critical as the panels themselves. So always make an informed decision based on their usage capabilities rather than their initial cost. Thanks for watching today's video. If you enjoyed it or learned something new, please give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to Electrical Field for more informative videos on electricity, solar energy, and more. Also, if there are any questions you would like us to answer or topics you'd like us to discuss in future videos, don't hesitate to let us know in the comments below. Until next time, remember, advance your electrical knowledge and keep the energy flowing.